seventh column. Hey, what's good guys? Welcome back to the channel. For those of you that are new, my name is Lanza, and in today's video, we're going to be going over my seventh column build on Gunslinger. Now, this isn't a guaranteed build, but this is definitely going to give you the edge. It's going to give you all the tools you need to get that seventh column. Now, on the left-hand side, you can see we're running Golden Gun Deadshot. The important part of this Golden Gun in particular is causing solar ignitions while your super is active refunds a golden gun round. You need to pair this with a fragment called Ember of Combustion. Final blows with your super cause targets to ignite. Now the reason why we're running dead shot over the traditional three shot is because of course you get more than three shots and you're going to need that to get seven kills. Now as for abilities we're running Gambler's Dodge, Strafe Jump, we are running the Stompy so this allows me to go faster, Weighted Throwing Knife and Trip Mine Grenades. These are all personal preference, you don't have to use these. As for aspects, we're running On Your Mark, which is essentially like Ophidians, but for Hunters and without the extended melee range. This is a phenomenal perk to run, I would highly recommend it. Precision Final Blows grant you and nearby allies increased weapon handling and reload speed for a short duration, stacks three times, also activates when you activate your class ability. This again is super important, this is another cherry on top. Knock them down, enhances your solar super. So Deadshot, Marksman's Dodge, and Blade Barrage each get a specific buff. Deadshot in particular, which is the one that we're using, gives us increased duration. Again, super important. It may be the last second or the last two seconds that you need to get that seventh kill. Now, as for fragments, like I said, Ember of Combustion is a must. And I would also say Ember of Eruption is also a must. Your solar super ignitions have increased area of effect. Both of these together is pretty much going to give you a huge explosion when you kill someone with Golden Gun and has the opportunity to kill somebody who is nearby. Now as for the other three slots, I'm running Ember of Beams for increased target acquisition on my Golden Gun shots. We also get an Intellect benefit. Ember of Char, your solar super ignition spreads Scorch to nearby targets. We also get a Discipline benefit. And then Ember of Searing, defeating Scorched targets grants melee energy. We also get a recovery benefit. Now, one thing to mention, and again, this is super important. This is something that you will sort of have to learn over time. But there is timing to this. There is skill in noticing the opportunity when it presents itself. So from experience, I can say that Endless Veil is definitely the easiest map to get a 7th column on. Quite simply because it's very easy to spawn kill on that map. And this plays a huge part in getting a 7th. And you'll see that in the gameplay coming up. Now I'll try my best to explain this to you. So, if you imagine Endless Veil, 6v6, the game's beginning. You have, let's say, myself and five of my teammates in my spawn. And then you have these six enemies as a team in their spawn. I'm going to run to the mid lane. Two people from the enemy team are also going to run to the mid lane. I'm going to kill those two people with a primary, let's say. So I currently have two kills. I'm then going to pop my golden gun and push towards those two kills as their other four teammates push to where I just got the first two kills. I'm going to kill those four people with my golden gun and then push deeper into their spawn and the first two people I killed are going to spawn up where they originally spawned and I'm going to kill them with my golden gun because I've still got it of course. And that right there is your 7th and your 8th kill, thus giving you a 7th column. Now I know that seems very simple in theory, but that is, the, that is what you need to notice. You do need to pay attention to where the enemies are spawning, sort of how many people are on the map. But when you're playing your 6v6 games, try and pay attention to the way that the spawns are working. And try and pay attention to uh, how many people are on the field, where your teammates are as well. Because if, if your teammates are too close to the enemy spawn, that is what's going to cause what we call a spawn flip. And that's where you will then spawn in the enemy spawn and the enemies will spawn in your spawn. As for my stat distribution, we're running 100, 300, 848. And we are gold for hashtag September gold. Now, if you found this video helpful, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Drop a like or a comment down below. Let me know what you think to the gameplay coming up. And I will catch you guys on the next one. I find an Iron Banner Lanza. I'm loving it. I'm fucking loving it, dude. I'm loving it. I'm loving it like this. Prove you are ready for a higher form of war. Two down. 
What? I shocked you first. FSD8H. Chat, have you guys noticed the Destiny 2 on the smaller maps is just a clusterfuck of abilities? The hunt has ended. What the fuck? What am I watching? Oh, wait, there was. Quiet. Return to the fight. Two down. Three opponents down. Another one off the list. That's one poke for me. Sad about it. No shot. He, <laughs> he stood me with, with the horde. Hunt. Fuck, man. Everything is yours. Relish this time. That's two. Three down. Like a return. Seventh column. Sheesh. That was cool. The hunt has ended. That wasn't so cool. <laughs> and boom. <laughs> what I feel like there's a guy crashing here. He is, there is. Fucking hell. Demon. Oh, he's nearly done it again. He's nearly stuck me again. Oh my goldie. It's almost over. Any orbs? Well, there you go, Logan. When even the Vanguard gets sloppy. There's a clip of TikTok. You, seventh you column. Have iron focus. Oh, you've never had a seventh? Okay, we got an 11 streak and we got a seventh column. My KD, bro. I think they need to remove that, if I'm honest with you. They need to get that off the um, the intro screen. Okay, where are the enemies? Wait, is that not eruption? I'm confused. I need to reset mentally. A powerful stings. The flames have ignited. Let the wolves hunt. The howls are quiet. Return to the fight. Oh, melee whiffs. Melee whiffs. Melee whiffs. The Let's just double check, shall we? Ignited. Yeah, it Let works. Fucking hunt. hell. The flames have gone cold. Two down. Oh, is this guy dead? Yeah, he is. Oh, I missed that. Oh, cancel me. Nice. I was like, from behind me. On your marks. Set. Go. No, there's a guy behind him. I missed two shots. Fuck. Hunt will come. Oh, you're getting a full on W key, sir. Two down. Two down. So that's a wall. Wait, what? That's two. Everything's yours. Relish this time. I'm not going to spawn back here, are they? Please. Fuck. I'm going to use my trip mine there. That guy's dead. Let's reload this. We might need it. I remove myself from that situation. What do you Let mean? Rest. 
What? The hunt is over. How does that freeze me? Hmm. That's it. You won. That was so cool, dude. Nice. You made it look almost effortless. Thank you.